hungry. Why aren't you eating? Hello? Michael, this is your mother. Remember me? I have some interesting news. Give me a call. I thought so. Seriously, honey, I thought I told you to get rid of the cat. Well, I, I wanted to wait until you got home before we discussed it. <coughs> so, you decided to keep it without even telling me? Well, you're always going on business, and, and I just thought it'd be nice to have a good friend, and you could just take anti-allergy medication when you're home. I'm not taking medication for a cat that does not even belong to you. Now, what's gotten into you? Is this some sort of empty nest syndrome? Oh, Alan, that's not fair. Andy, now I know how you feel. I'll find her a good home. Seeking a good pet owner for a beautiful, friendly cat. Must have references. Oh, oh, she's beautiful. Hi, honey. Oh, I hope she'll get along with my little ones. Oh, you have kids? No, just cats. <laughs> oh, how many? Well, with Lily, 14. It's not including my outdoor cats. Well, technically, we're not allowed to have animals in our dorm. But we don't mind sneaking it in. I mean, we could just like shove it in a backpack or something. Um, I have two pit bulls, Jerry and Bobo. Are they good with cats? They love cats. But tell me one thing, is she a good fighter? Hush little kitty, don't you cry. How often do you need to feed it? Like, every other day? Mama's gonna bake you a tuna pie. <laughs> this is all your fault. What? I just can't find her a good home. What about your son? Mike? He doesn't even return my calls. Really? Well, he picks up for me, and he's not even my son. What about a shelter? No way! Don't just give her to anyone. And she's my cat! May I remind you that this is my apartment and not yours? I can't believe you just said that. And she's not going anywhere until I say she is. Oh, God. Lily? 
to a shelter? <sighs> 306 East 59th Street. Excuse me. I'm looking for a fluffy brown cat. She's got uh, green eyes and a short nose. Uh, she was brought in here earlier today. You don't say. Well, have you seen her? Might this be her? Yes, yes, that's my cat. Oh, thank God. Can I take her home now? The man who brought her here was my boyfriend, and he had no right to bring her in here. Once an animal is dropped off here, the only way they are getting out is through adoption. Now, if you'd like to adopt Lily, you're going to have to wait three business days for her to get all of her shots, and there is a $100 adoption fee. No, no, I, I'll pay the money. I don't care about that. But, but what if someone gets her first? Can you hold her for me? I'm sorry, ma'am, but that's not our policy. If somebody wants to adopt them, we give them to the people on the spot. Well, okay, look, look, here's like $200. I, I promise I'll get all her shots and I'll get her spayed. I'm going home and I'm taking my cat with me. Hey, Mom. Now you call me. Yeah. Sorry, I've been really down lately, but, you know, uh, I'm a little short on rent this month. I, I know I've been kind of a douche, but I was wondering, you know, if you could help me out. Oh, that's funny, because I was just about to call you and ask you for a favor. Hey, Mom. Hi, honey. Are you all right? Yeah. Oh, is this her? Come on out, it's okay. Oh, good girl. I can't believe I have a cat. Well, now you have the pet you always wanted. Now, where's my room? <laughs>